we were meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dreams. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality. Hello, Virgo. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so, okay? All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. I want to give a shout out to New York, LA, Philadelphia, Atlanta, Houston, London, Dallas, Chicago, Florida. Um, I have high viewership there. And I want to say thank you to all who... Um, view everywhere, but definitely let me know where you're viewing from down in the comment section. Um, thank you again. Uh, keep in mind that readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off at the website level. Um, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Virgo, when I was meditating off camera for you, what I was getting was like frustration, like upset, like just throwing the papers up in the air. I don't know if you need to take a break or something, but just frustration. Then the high, uh, high priestess was at the bottom of the deck. So maybe you do like something with like bookkeeping or record keeping or keeping up with something or um, maybe keeping up with clientele or clients or um, this could even be phone calls. This could be working from home, having a hard time keeping up, you know. Um, let's see what's going on for you, Virgo. So maybe just take a break, uh, step back, take a break, plan a vacation. Let's see. The moon card, so that is associated with Virgo, okay? It reduces to a nine. Nine is hermit card. So maybe your emotions are stirred here. You've been lying to yourself. I heard overwork, burned out, work, burning the candles at, burning the candle at both ends, uh, working at night, working in, working during the day. Um, you're just kind of frustrated with, frustrated with the process, frustrated with what they're doing, or they, I don't know, what they're doing or what um, is going on here. Um, wanting change, okay? Um, try not to be emotional about it. This is the last ditch effort. This is the last time they do this to you. This is the last time you're here on this thing or you're here this late. Okay, yeah, nine of cups, that's associated with you. You, you want to live lap of luxury. You want to enjoy the fruits of your labor. You want to get to a place of maybe abundance and just uh, enjoying yourself, relaxation. The seven of swords, it's like you want to go it on your own or do your own thing or you're thinking about maybe leaving or keeping your secrets plan, keeping your plan secret. Wow, you're so tired. You're just talking backwards, huh? Um, the world, yeah, you're thinking about maybe secretly putting a, a stop a, into this chapter, moving on. Um, yeah, the Three of Cups, having victory, success, triumph somewhere else, commercial success. Maybe you're into something, you know, commercial, pretty big. Um, you're, you're thinking about maybe next level graduation, maturing, whatever that may be. What is the three of cups for Virgo? The four of wands, successful completion of a project, high esteem of yourself right now, feeling like you want to take loved ones out. Um, you could like be in a circle of girls. You could have a lot of girls at your house. You could be, a, um, a mother of a lot of girls or girls or father of girls. I don't know. Um, something about women, lots of women, mother of, children, women, house, 
the three of cups may want to reconcile maybe with an ex or with a feminine energy um you want to reconcile some things in regards to let's talk about it in regards to me coming back home or home what else is this i'm uh, the hangman yeah what sacrifice i'm going to make or i will take to actually be in the home i'm going to make sacrifices i'm going to do this i've come to enlightenment that this is the best place for me to be um you may get around colleagues also and ask about other job opportunities so or yeah or friends so you can move on and you don't have to sacrifice so much of your life and your time something about sacrifice you have the magician here coming out with a plan taking matters into your own hands you could be a salesman or you could do something in regards to sales or you have your speech or what you say you have to be trusting or you have to get people to trust you this is you virgo you could be someone who uh, writes also this is a writer to someone i don't know it's like you're really trying you want to take a break so that you can actually write or do what it is you want to do or make your dreams come true manifestation make it come to fruition and stop just thinking about it um what else is going on here um you also what you were waiting for somebody to want to come around and want to be a husband or a boyfriend or, or whatever or uh responsible reliable in a relationship you were waiting maybe you're, you're gonna take time out and stop waiting or you're gonna come out of the hangman hanged man stage the two of pentacles the ten of pentacles yeah you're weighing up um a decision pros and cons looking over balances book books checkbooks profit and loss um you could work for a very powerful man somebody who has a lot of money a lot of you know prestige direction here um, you're doing a lot of work for this person everything is up in the air in regards to if you're going to stay or go um, the Ten of Pentacles here. Maybe you have money um, that you have saved up or you feel like you need to save more. Um, the Knight of Swords. This is somebody like wondering, like, I'm too devoted and dedicated to this empire, to this corporation, to this business. You could work at a bank, or at this particular bank. Or you could be in banking. You might want to change banks or change jobs. You're tired of working so late or working so much not getting paid what you're worth or the pay is decent or it is good but it is not worth the headache the stress yeah you're looking for a new opportunity maybe start your own thing or just go somewhere else or get another offer um you want to materialize something make it come to fruition you want to actualize something self-actualization coming to the a high potential or the highest um psychological uh development and understanding your true potential so before you can actually do anything make a move like start your own business or whatever it, you ha it starts in the brain it starts in the mind so that's what the ace of pentacles is it's like the implantation the uh the seed being planted in your mind that hey i can actually do this come into the highest psychological mind development that you know of uh, 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 trusting your true potential or your potential Okay, so it's just potential, but it's knowing that, hell, I can do this. I've done this. I am doing this. I am running a business, though it is not mine. So it's like you coming to a manifestation within yourself that you got to do something for yourself or you need to make some move or you want to make a move. You're tired of um, what's going on here. Yeah, you want to start something new for yourself, have more time for maybe your babies or just yourself or a lap of luxury. Um, I heard selling a business also, you might want to let it go. Uh, it's taking too much of your time and you just don't want to do this anymore. This is what I have for you, Virgo. Oh, let me get your outcome. What's the outcome for Virgo? What's the outcome for Virgo? Outcome. Okay, the page of wands. So you're going to come out renewed. You can, you can say, hey, I can actually do this. Um, you're going to explore, okay? Explore your opportunities, okay? Put something out there. Put the fillers out there. Someone could even be offering you a promotion. Yeah, three of swords, but it's going to be bittersweet because you you might want to leave, okay? Yeah, the ten of wands. It's too much, too much work. Cracking under the, the weight of your own success. You know, you knowing how to do the job so well that they put it all on you. And now it's just a big-ass burden. You just keep showing up for it. And you may move on from this um, turbulent job environment. Um, you may move on in secrecy and silence. So you're not being real loud about that. Um, that is what I have for you, all right? Thank you, Virgo, for being here. Many blessings to you. Get your own personal reading if you wanna drill down on your 
uh, energy. Readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off at checkout. If you took something from the reading, you can always get back. You can buy me a coffee. The link is below. Catch my live stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you're a business-minded individual or you want to start your own business, get around people who are doing it or who are starting it. Um, get valuable business information by uh, joining the monthly KTMG Keep the Momentum Going co uh, monthly conference call held with yourself um, if you decide to sign up and uh, many others, okay? Get valuable business information that will help you on your journey, okay? And if you already have your own business or you wanna see where you are in business, if I can be of assistance to you, go ahead and schedule your complimentary discovery call, okay? Uh, thank you, many blessings to you, take care.